like drummers. Drummers are cool. Uh, he was with the uh, 2007 Shiner Bach Rising Star winners, the Truck Star Truck Stop Junkies. That's pretty cool. That's a cool name. If I wasn't an LSD, I'd take that name. <laughs> I like my name. Um, 2010 Fall Indie Fest Best Country Act in, of People's Choice, the Marfalites. Who will be at our next show, or not the next one, the one after, at City Tavern. And the drummer for the new, newly formed Texas Red Legs. That's a cool name, too. So he's a drummer, been in the business for a little while. He's probably been drumming longer than you guys have been alive. He's so cute. I love my little high schoolers. I love them. It's only because I wish I was still in high school. College! Oh, you're in college now? Oh, sorry. I have some chest hair. Come on. Oh, yeah. I have some chest hair. I, you know, I, I totally stereotyped you guys. I'm sorry. You can stereotype me if you want to. Don't call it out loud. All right, and our next, our next judge, the lovely Diana Oliver. Been friend of mine for what, eight, nine years now? A while. Yeah. She is film producer with Thunderbird Productions, and her movie just came out. Hempsters plant the seed. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, she, there's Willie Nelson, Woody Harrelson, and Merle Haggard are in that movie. That's pretty cool. You like those? And a lot more, a lot more, a lot more. And last but not least, my guitar player in my band, well, our band, sorry, <laughs> Mr. Billy Blair. Yeah. He's, he's been around, uh, he's been from El Paso to Texas about 10 years ago, started up uh, doing a lot of movies and uh, music and everything. So he's been uh, Surgeon General on the Target Skull Diggers. He's toured nationally with Earshot, and now he's in Love Stricken Demise. Yeah, yeah. He was also in Mongolian Deathworm, Jonah Hex, and Machete. Hey. Machete. And he killed Robert De Niro, Machete. Which is really cool, because only two people in the world have done that. And he got ate by a worm. Saturday on TV. Saturday on Sci-Fi. Yeah. Okay, so we have three performing artists. That's plural. Uh, tonight, and our first is Michael Prysock. He's from Arkansas. Have you ever been to Arkansas? I've been there. No Razorback. <laughs> All right, there you go, Shelly. He's actually been a tour. He's a self uh, self promotion type touring artist, and he's been around for a few years. Really awesome, awesome guy, and really nice. He's just so really too nice. He's so cute. Okay, we'll give it up for Michael Prysock. I'm originally from Arkansas, uh, about 30 miles south of Little Rock. I'm in between where Billy Bob Thornton was born, where he made sling blades. So I'm in the middle. I'm in Dallas, Texas. Now I met me a woman at a wedding, and she told me I was moving to Dallas. So here I am. Y'all been good to me. Played here Friday night, and I was well, these are these deer are from these are Iceland deer. They killed them in Iceland. I told my wife I was gonna tell that joke, anybody got it. And I was always confused, I thought. In school, they told me that Greenland was cold and Iceland was the one that had grass. And my wife looked at me like I was crazy. I said, I guess I didn't listen. This song's called Throwing Rocks at the Train. If you're from a small town, I'm sure you've done the same. What do you say, Jeff? Do
never got it, but I think my daddy did. That boy acts a lot like me back when I was a kid. Always in the summer, never any good. Doing what he shouldn't, instead of doing what he should. I guess my daddy must be the one to blame.
took a job and thought I'd save my money. But that nine to five don't sit too well with me, honey. Man said, boy, you best not come back. Say, change your mind when you see my old. I got a good woman that says she pay my bill. She likes to tell me how she feels. Love that woman, boys, and that's a fact. Bad like I love my old bad like I go back home to town to town. Like she Thank you. 